So we've talked about hardwood, linoleum, and even ceramic tile floors here on this channel. Those three pieces of cleaning gold will be listed and linked down below. But now, it's time to talk about laminate floors. For years, you have longed for laminate, deep in your heart. It was instant infatuation since the day that you met. The sun was shining and the skies were blue. However, out of control kids and rambunctious animals have left you lamenting your laminate. Well, my friends, dry your eyes. A life of laminate luxury awaits. Because in today's video, I'm going to show you how to clean those floors with confidence. So to clean your laminate floors, you're going to need one of these little puppies right here. This is a microfiber, a flat microfiber spray mop. So this is just a pad right here, microfiber, like as I mentioned. I'll repeat myself over and over, right? It's what I do. I have a bad habit of it, sorry. Anyways, this is styrofoam, so it just comes apart here. And then you just pull the pad off when it gets dirty, wash it, and then hang it to dry. So, um, also... Here's where you're going to put your cleaning solution, right here. So just press this little button, pop this container off, put your cleaning solution in here, pop it back on, you're ready to go. Here's the little spray trigger right here. So you pull the trigger and it comes out this little spout. So here, take this little cap off. When you use it, it'll just come squirting out that little spout right there. You can purchase one of these mops at Walmart for like 20 bucks. However, if you want one that's even better in quality, the brand Rubbermaid makes one that's absolutely fantastic. Highly, highly recommend it. I will leave a link to that product in the video description box to this video if you want to go that route. If not, then just head to Walmart, pick up this thing for like 20 bucks, and you will be ready to go to work. Now let's talk about the cleaning solution you're gonna wanna use. What you want is rubbing alcohol. You're going to use a half cup of this stuff. This has a drying agent, so it's going to help the laminate floors dry faster once you apply it and start mopping. And it also is a disinfectant. Yay, yay. So, um, half cup of this will go in the container. And you're also going to use this. This is a Mrs. Meyer's Clean Day Multi-Surface Concentrate. So it's an all-purpose cleaner, but this is a great all-purpose cleaner because it doesn't leave any kind of residue. It just works really well on laminate floors, and it smells fantastic. What can I say? This is lemon. Um, they have lavender also, and a couple other flavors or scents. So just get whatever you want. This is 32 ounces. This is the bottle you're going to want. It's a, just a concentrate. So uh, what you're going to put is a cap, one cap. So half cup of rubbing alcohol, one cap of this stuff, and fill the rest up with water. One thing I need to mention before we get started, the reason we're only using one cap of this stuff is you don't want to use too much all-purpose cleaner because if you use too much, the floors will end up turning out sticky and you don't want that. Also, you never want to use any kind of waxes or polishes on your laminate floors. Just stick to this simple DIY solution that I've given you here and you're going to be golden. Like golden egg or something or I don't know, gold necklace, gold ring, diamond ring, I don't know. Okay, so after you vacuumed or swept up your floors and you got your mixture all mixed, it's pretty simple. Go to mopping. Now, if you want to get really comfortable, kick off your shoes while you're at it and start the process. So, it's very simple. We pull our trigger, we spray our floors, and we mop with the grain. Spray. And start mopping with the grain. So that's it. There's not much to it. Just go through, do all your floors like that, and you'll be good to go. My friends, that's all I got for you. If you liked the video, give it a big clean with confidence thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel for more great content. And click the little bell notification right next to that subscribe button to make sure you're notified every time I upload a new video. With that being said, implement the steps I've outlined in this video for you, and you will be well on your way to becoming the domesticated cleaning savage that I know you are.